Hello Silver Stackers and Collectors, Silverstruck here, and welcome to my channel. If this is your first time here, welcome. If you've been to my channel before, welcome back. If you like Silver Stacker and Metals Collecting, maybe a little of each, I hope you enjoy watching. So these are my uh, latest pickups. Uh, one's from an LCS and the rest is from online. Um, I tried buying in the dip like a lot of stackers like to do. And so this is what I was able to pick up um, on uh, my short-term budget. And we'll start with this first piece right here, which is a gold coin. This is a 10th ounce, 2020 uh, Cook Island coin. And look at the reverse. Pretty cool ship. It's a $10 face value. A couple reasons why I picked this coin up instead of like, uh, say, the American Eagle, which uh, which is a great coin. Uh, you, you know, I would uh, definitely recommend stacking the American Eagles. But in the fractionals here, in the 10th ounce, this coin had a lot less of a premium on it. Matter of fact, I was able to pick it up for $217 uh, versus uh, the same uh, 10th ounce American Eagle was around 200 30 uh, to 233 so about a, a 6-7% premium difference um, the other thing that attracted me to this coin is it's 4 nines pure instead of 3 nines pure not that that was a huge factor but I like the coin and then with that on top of it I was like alright uh, Cook Islands you can save some money have 4 nines pure gold and, and uh, um, enjoy the coin um, so anyway uh, that's that's the uh, tenth ounce gold I was able to add to the stack, so it's slow going adding to the gold stack, but we are getting there. Uh, the rest are silver, and uh, let's start for the silver pieces. Uh, I found this in my LCS. I've already done. I've already shot this video about twenty times between uh, this one and the uh, the next one I'm going to show you. I've done I've done a face reveal many many times with these, so I'm going to try again here. Um, even though it says Atmex on the label on this, it. Uh, it was found in my generic bin at the coin dealer, which is a very important point. Is that this is a really cool bar. This is a 2012 uh, Year of the Dragon bar. And, uh, you know, as far as generic silver goes, it's a pretty neat chunk of generic silver. These are semi collectible. There are people that, uh, stackers that like to collect it. Now, let's flip it that way real quick. See if, uh, see if I missed doing a face reveal. Check out the, uh, the chunkage on that. Pretty good. Nice bar. And the other cool feature, of course, is the reverse it actually has something going on. Uh, three nines pure silver. And then it has Chinese symbols. So we have uh, power, brave, strong, honest, and luck. So this is my first one of these bars. I'm not a collector of this series of bars. But if I keep finding them in my uh, L LCS's uh, generic bin, I'll definitely be picking them up, especially for uh, cheaper premiums. So moving on from there, this was a purchase from online. Actually, I'll show it to you first. You guys probably all recognize these. Uh, Jay and Bullion's been pushing these pretty hard. So it's uh, generic rounds, uh, three nines, pure silver, one troy ounce. And uh, I like these rounds. I just chose these because um, I like the finish. That's basically it. I mean, it's a generic round, so you try to buy the cheapest generics you can you can get. And uh, these were them. I can't remember how much over spot. I want to say maybe a couple dollars over spot. And uh, what I like about this these particular rounds is that it has a uh, like a uh, frosty field and deep mirror devices kind of proof finish to it. So um, I don't know if you're gonna have generic silver. Try to get what you like. I'm not gonna bother wearing gloves uh, to handle generic rounds as nice as they may be. Stack what you like. And I think that's important. You know, there's a lot of opinions out there of what a stack, including my own, and I say as long as you're happy stacking and you're saving money and um, preparing for the future, you should be good to go. Speaking of that, I've always wanted one of these. I'm more of a stacker of bars, not so much the fractionals either, but uh, this is a Valcami Swiss bar, and this is 100 grams, 
And you can see the reflective nature of these bars. So if I get through this without a face reveal, it would be a miracle. So the thing I really like about this is that it's uh, broken into different chunks. So you can break off uh, 10 grams at a time. It's uh, three nines pure. And uh, I get a kick out of the, uh, instead of a decimal uh, between the uh, three nines and the zero, they have a, a comma there. A little different. Comes with instructions. If you needed instructions to operate this bar, there may be other problems. <laughs> So, but there it is. Uh, you can uh, you can snap the bars off uh, one at a time, and this is you know in a uh, SHFT uh, situation, really is is where that would come into play. Uh, other than that, it's just uh, a cool way to stack 100 grams. The rear is okay. I mean, kind of plain. Yeah. So there you have it. Th those are my. My latest pickups, a little bit of silver and a tiny piece of gold hiding under there. And uh, before I go, I'd like to mention one more thing. Um, I'd like to thank uh, Silver Scorpion for doing a, a shout out. Uh, it added a lot of subscribers and I really appreciate it. Um, really cool that he did that. And so even though he has way more subscribers than I do, I'm going to uh, show his channel for everybody to see. So if you haven't seen Silver Scorpion's channel, definitely check him out. Uh, he does some really cool pours. Um, he does some aluminum pours, copper pours. He did a copper Batman. Uh, really cool stuff. So love his channel. He's a good guy. I appreciate the shout out. So shout out right back to you, Silver Scorpion. So that's it. I hope you enjoyed watching. If you did, hit that like button. Leave me some comments. What kind of silver are you stacking lately and why? What are your premiums like? I hope you enjoyed watching. Thank you so much.